You're getting to be a big boy. I'm just a kid who's four. Each day I grow some more. I like exploring. I'm Caillou. So many things to do. Each day is something new. I'll share them with you. I'm Caillou. My world is turning, changing each day. With mommy and daddy, I'm finding my way. Growing up is not so tough. Caillou's Gym Day. It was a beautiful day, so Caillou and his mommy were taking a walk to go mail some letters. I'll race you to the mailbox. <laughs> hey, you didn't say go. Hi, Andre. Want a race? I can't. I'm going to my gym class. Why doesn't Caillou come, too? I could bring him back to your house after. Well, I don't see why not. How about it? Do you want to go? Hi there. This is Caillou. Would you like to join the class? Caillou felt shy. Um, okay. But he still wanted to try. Everybody, this is Caillou. Okay, everyone, we're gonna start off with some stretches. So reach your arms up to the ceiling. Mm, I'm touching the sky. Now, stretch to one side, then the other. That's it. And touch your toes. Andre, <laughs> look at me. Now, make big circles with your arms. Caillou was really trying, but it was hard to do the exercises. When I hit this drum, I want you to stomp your feet like this. Ready? Go! Look! One, two, one, two. Caillou tried again. He wanted to show the teacher he could do it. I did it! Okay, everyone. It's time to try the next exercise. Leapfrog. <laughs> One person bends down, head tucked in, and the other jumps over. Ribbit, ribbit, I'm a frog. I'm gonna try. Leaping over Andre was not easy. Caillou was a little bit discouraged. <gasps> try again. This time, Andre, keep your head really tucked in. Go on, Caillou. Good class, everyone. See you next time. Thanks for coming, Caillou. Let's play gym class. <laughs> I want to be the gym teacher. You can be a frog. Caillou was having fun pretending to be the gym teacher. Ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> It's time to go home. You did it! Caillou was very proud to have completed the leapfrog all by himself. It made him feel confident. Bye, Andre. Why are you wearing the whistle? I'm a gym teacher. <coughs> Our rocket ship. because he and his best friend, Leo, had decided they were going to play rocket ship all day. Are we going to the park now? You bet we are. Bye, Caillou. Bye, Rosie. Bye. Park ahead. Yay! Way to go, Rosie. My rocket ship flies faster than yours. No, mine does. Coming in for a landing. I'm landing too. This is a space station.
action. Seeing Caillou and Leo having so much fun, Rosie decided she wanted to play, too. Uh, Rosie, no! <sighs> Daddy! I'm sure she didn't mean to. Me, too. Ooh! No, Rosie! Caillou was very upset. He knew Rosie wanted to help, but she kept undoing everything. our space station. Okay. Maybe Rosie is too little to help with your space station. Rosie, want to play catch with me? Catch! Okay, let's go. Yay! <laughs> we land lots of rocket ships here. Come on, you two. Time to go. Do we have to? It's time for Rosie's nap. Caillou thought it was unfair they had to leave because of Rosie's nap. I want to play with Leo. You can play with Leo at home. We can build another space station at your place. Okay. Come on, Daddy, hurry. Get ready for blast off. Caillou. Rosie did not want to have a nap. She wanted to go and play with her big brother, Caillou. Okay, Rosie. Nap time. Five, four, three, two, one. Look, Mommy. We flew through the tire. Shh. May I ask that you be a little quieter? Rosie's taking her nap. Blast-offs are loud. Caillou hated to have to play quietly just because Rosie was having her nap. They are loud. Hmm. But after blast off, what happens when you're out in space? I don't know. Me neither. Well, if I were in space, I'd put on my spacesuit and go out into space for a spacewalk. Hold on. You forgot to put on your spacesuits. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Let's go. This way! Hmm. What do we have here? We're in space! Okay, you two, float to planet Daddy! I'm returning to base. Okay, space mommy! Hey! What are you two doing? <laughs> We're landing on Planet no. Daddy! <laughs> yeah. Bet you didn't know there was a tickle monster on Planet Daddy, did you? <laughs> Planet Daddy? Where could that be? Hi, Mr. Hinkle. Hi, boys. You know, I just got a new refrigerator, and it came in this big box. I think it'd make a great spaceship, if you're interested. Wow! A spaceship! Should we make the top here? We need a door. There you go, Caillou. Hmm. What do you say we put the tail fin here? Do it. Me too. There. Now all we have to do is decorate it. Wow, the rocket ship looks great. Rosie felt she had been left out of all the fun Leo and Caillou were having. She wanted to play with the rocket ship too. Me too. Caillou didn't want Rosie scribbling on the rocket ship. He was starting to get annoyed with her. No, Rosie. Caillou, that isn't a very nice way to treat Rosie. She's just trying to help. She's wrecking the spaceship. Maybe there's a different way Rosie can help. I have an idea how we can make something for the rocket ship that Caillou's going to love. We'll need this. 
Can we go in it now? Are you finished? Uh-huh. Are you sure? I think it needs a flag. Rosie made it. Thank you, Rosie. Caillou was very impressed by her beautiful flag. And Rosie was Yay! very happy she <laughs> finally got to help with the <laughs> rocket ship. <laughs> we can put it on top. Great idea. Ta-da! <laughs> I think we're ready for our first flight. Rosie ready, too. Caillou, you can sit here, Rosie. Prepare for blast off! <laughs> Seat belts on. Five. Four, three, two, one, blast off! Rocket! And so Leo, Caillou, <laughs> and their special flag maker Rosie blasted off into space. Caillou helps Grandpa. How much longer, Daddy? Caillou was impatient to get to Grandma and Grandpa's house. Today, Caillou, his daddy, and Grandpa were going skating. We're almost there. Why don't you try to walk in my footprints? <laughs> Hi, Grandpa! Hi! Hi, you two! Would you look at all this snow? If we're gonna drive to the skating rink, I think we need to clear this driveway first. Well, let's get to work then. How about it, Caillou? Caillou saw how much snow there was. He wanted to help. Good. The more help we have, the faster the work will get done. There are extra shovels in the house. Caillou thought it was hard work to keep up. That's good. Keep going. Uh, Daddy, help! It's stuck. Pull hard. Uh, uh, uh. Ow! Caillou had another idea of how he could help. I'm going to work here. <laughs> hey, here comes some more. <laughs> Watch out! <laughs> Time out. If we want to get to that skating rink, we'd better get back to work. I think I'll start on the walkway. What's this? Can I have it, Grandpa? Sure, be my guest. Caillou discovered that the flower pot was very useful to carry snow and that it was great to build snow castles. Daddy, come see what I made. Look at the castles. Wow! Caillou was proud that his grandpa and daddy liked his castles. They're the biggest castles ever! a lot, Grandma. He sure did a good job. <sighs> what about skating? You should probably head out soon. How about we skate tomorrow, Caillou? Caillou? Caillou was too busy to answer because he heard something outside. Wow! More snow! I can make snow castles again! <sighs> Yard bowlers. Hi, Grandma. Hello, Caillou. Caillou's mommy had just dropped him and Rosie off to spend the afternoon with Grandma and Grandpa. What's that? It's Grandpa's old bowling trophy. He won this prize for being the best player. Yep, I used to be quite the bowler in my day. 
Come on, I think I still have my bowling ball here somewhere. It was the most unusual ball Caillou had ever seen. Careful, it's heavy. Caillou wondered how anyone could play a game with such a heavy ball. Can you show me how to play? Sure, Caillou, but first we need to get a few things that are more your size. Looks like we've got everything. Caillou was very curious to see how this game would work. Me too. Okay, Rosie, Grandpa will show you how to bowl too. That looks perfect. This'll be our bowling alley. Me too. Come on, Rosie. You can help set up the pins. <laughs> you put them like this. See, Rosie? I think we're ready to bowl. Bowling was a lot of fun. Rosie, too. Telephone, it's for you. Okay, dear. Now that you're such a good bowler, maybe you can show Rosie how to play while I'm gone. Caillou was proud that Grandpa thought he was good at bowling. Okay, Rosie, roll the ball over there. Try again. Caillou and Rosie were both getting frustrated. I know. Move closer. <laughs> Yay! Caillou, Rosie, time for a snack. Wow, it looks as good as new. And here's a couple of special trophies for my champion bowlers. And yours is also for being so good at helping your sister. Caillou felt very proud. Thank you, Grandma. Hello. Hi, Mommy. We played bowling. Mommy, see. Bowling? Who taught you how to do that? Grandpa showed me, and I showed Rosie. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> Caillou's milk run. Cereal, Daddy! Hey there, sleepyhead. <sighs> or should I say sleepy heads? Caillou thought it was funny that everyone was yawning, too. It was catching. Daddy's Diner is now open for breakfast, and we're taking special requests on this fine morning. So, what's it gonna be, young man? Cereal, please. Me, me, me! And for the lovely lady, may I suggest some scrambled <laughs> cocos? <laughs> You're silly, Daddy. And would the little boy get the moo milk from the fridge, s'il vous plaît? Only one happy about Caillou's accident was Gilbert. Milk? Sorry, Rosie, but there's no more milk left for your cereal. It's okay, Rosie. We'll make you some eggs. <coughs> or, or how about some toast with honey? The only thing that Rosie wanted was a bowl of cereal. Caillou felt bad. He didn't mean to spill the milk. Then he remembered where he could get more milk. We can go get more milk at the store. That's a great idea, Caillou. Let's get dressed. Can you pick up some bread while you're at it? I'll get Rosie to eat something else in the meantime. You're walking too fast. Mommy, look! Caillou 
thought the drawing was even more beautiful now that it was a happy sun. this game with his mommy so much that they decided to play it all the way home. Green light. Red light, mommy. We're home. Caillou was proud to have helped by bringing back some milk. He was looking forward to a good bowl of cereal. Cereal, too. You're still hungry after everything you ate? Ready? Green light. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Rosie. She's my baby sister, and I love her. We play games together a lot. And we have fun. I get to show her things I like. And sometimes I help take care of her. <laughs> because I'm her big brother. 